We want to see the real Lagos. Yes, let's go. Welcome to Lagos, Nigeria. It feels very magical, mainly because of the process, right? Now, with the love I had for the Walt Disney Company, it, it's a dream, especially if you grew up in Africa. You don't really think you're gonna get this. Happy birthday, Tola. This is our team. He wants that story pet. It's great. With animation, you know how in Lagos, people carry things on their head to sell in the traffic. What if in animation, the person is carrying about four layers of bread, which you can't get in live action. Living in Lagos, I noticed the mainland island divide, you know, where the, the wealthy are on the island, the, the less fortunate or the poor people are on the mainland. And I'm a sci-fi nerd, you know, I read so many sci-fi books, so many sci-fi stories, and I'm, I'm, I kid you not, a world where the geography supports the societal divide is the kind of thing a science fiction author would, would create. Futurizing it, interestingly, we wanted to hold on to the culture and the soul of Lagos, I hope that came through. And that means everything we featureized was purposely built just for Lagos. We do not get sci-fi tropes and try to introduce them into Nigeria and that's how we create that world. It was more like, okay, in Lagos, there's this insane traffic. If you're rich, you'd have money to buy a flying car versus, oh, flying cars, we should add flying cars because it's the future. It was more of that approach. It is super exciting for us because this really is a first, this collaboration between Walt Disney Animation Studios and Kugali and you know at, at Disney you know our key focus is to really uh, tell stories that are authentic and that are focused on creativity and innovation. Don't love your daddy has done well.